Good morning everyone from a beautiful, beautiful day here at Beltona Cottage. In fact it's a beautiful morning. It's still around about 11am. Incredibly blue sky. Virtually no cloud cover. Getting quite warm. As you can see I've got both the front door and the back door open. Just walk through. I don't know if any of you noticed before but the front and back door of the cottage are in perfect alignment. It's very cool and lovely just walking through it. Because the cottage is built from stone I want to thank everyone who left comments yesterday on the video I posted and also for the masses of comments on the Facebook page Beltona Cottage Goddess Gardens they're all very much appreciated I can tell you because many of you know that I live here on my own that I work on my own I don't have anyone here to help and at times it can be a little bit solitary. Most of the time it's actually wonderful. But there are times, you know, I'm sure you can understand when I open up the pages to the outside world, whether that be on YouTube or the occasional newspaper that comes my way, Twitter, Facebook, and I get rather disheartened, rather disheartened at all the stuff that's happening in the world of man. So to actually make that connection with so many of you and just realise that there are so many good hearts out there and I'm not the only person who feels the way I feel about the earth and about the importance of connecting with the Great Mother. So it's really heartening to read the comments and just to know that you're there. So thank you. Thank you. Someone wrote a beautiful poem about Gaia and left it on the Facebook page. It's there about halfway down in the comments. Beautiful read. Jack? Good boy. Good boy. I think that when the weather is like this, it appears to be quite hot all over the world. The importance of trees and the tree cover really comes home. Just walking down along here with this sort of dappled shade. It's so cool and pleasant. I'll just go down as far. That's where the little laneway walks in, leads in past the hazel tree. Jack, come on. This way, this 
way. Come on. There's one of the hazel trees. Sort of like a golden silver. Easter Island Man, a reminder of the importance of regarding the earth as our mother and not as something that we just keep extracting from. They built monuments as they cut down the trees and eventually the island couldn't support life. I think that's what all so-called civilizations have done. In abusing the mother, 
they have destroyed themselves. It's a solitary lesson really. If we protect and care for the mother, the divine feminine, Gaia, the goddess, then all will be well. All will be well. <laughs>